So, Lee, 3-1 win in the FA Cup fourth qualifying round. You must be delighted with that. Yeah, definitely. First half, we were a um, little bit too respectful of them and the way they played. Um, and we concentrated too much on nullifying them rather than being ourselves. And uh, we flipped it a little bit at half-time and the formation changed a bit and uh, we're much better in the second half and in the end deserved win as a fact. Yeah, I was going to say they scored at a bad time for us, I would say. Um, what was said at half-time? Because their heads must have been down at the break, no? Yeah, we just gave a silly free kick away and, um, and made a bad decision off the back of that and uh, give them a, a leg up, really. I thought it was a pretty even game in the first half. Um, but second half, we upped our intensity a little bit and, uh, and we got after them higher up the pitch. Changed formation, as I said, and that seemed to work quite well. Yeah, we had uh, EDS player Kaya Shaka on the bench. Obviously, he didn't come on, but still a great experience for him, do you think? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I mean, for him to be involved at his age is great. You know, we've got uh, another one coming on the pitch today in Oscar Rutherford, uh, another boy that's come out of that. So, yeah, you know, we're proud of our elite development squad at the club and uh, I'd like to give them a pathway through and it gives us an opportunity to involve them today. One gets on and one doesn't, but um, there'll be other times, I'm sure, where it, it would be involved. We spoke before the game about how, how many goals Dorking likes to score. Um, we limited them to just one today. Yeah. Um, is that good defending or is that still obviously one too many? Um, I think the manner of the goal was disappointing as far as we um, give a poor free kick away, 30 seconds for half time, and then and then Cease gets dragged out in the middle. But, um, it's just a communication thing. And I just said that we've got enough experience in the group for them to be able to sort of talk to each other and communicate and, and make that an easier transition to be able to defend. And... Uh, once we got to grips with that, we were much better. Yeah, obviously it's nice to have the fans here today. I thought they were in good voice all throughout. Um, yeah, how what did you make of them? Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, well, down in that corner, it's nice that you know we've come from behind, and and uh, I think it was a game game of two halves really, as far as the way we approached it. And uh, I think think they see a team that's you know that's proud to wear the shirt, as I've said before, work hard and uh, give them something to go and to cheer about, and uh, look forward to the draw on uh, Monday night. Yeah, and just thankfully, there's no replay on Tuesday, so our next game is Solihull Moors away. Yeah. Um, yeah, how are you feeling about that one? Yeah, yeah, looking forward to it. I mean, good pitch there, a good club. Um, we've got a bit of momentum going now, and it's another another win on the road that we can sort of get that monkey off our back of um, not not having a great away record. We've we've turned the corner as far as that in recent weeks, and uh, I think that's five unbeaten now. So we need to try and continue that, but it'll be a tough one at Solihull. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you.